Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. So here we are discussing the question dice number on courtship. So the problem states that Alice and Bob are playing a game. Each player rolls a regular six faced dice three times. Score of player is the maximum number that can be found using the rolls. The player with great highest score wins and game ends in a tie if both players have same score. Find the winner of the game or determine whether it's a tie. So the input format is single integer t containing number of test cases and the test case contains a1, a2, a3, b1, b2 and b3. Means the values Alice gets in 3 dice rolls followed by values which Bob gets. So we need to output Alice if Alice wins, Bob if Bob wins and tie in the case of a tie. So here is the input, first input. So in the first input as we see, the f first is a1, a2, a3 is 3 to 5. So we can form maximum 532. And the next for b, it is 611. So as 611 is greater, so bob wins. In second case, in this also it is 544 and this also 544. So, it's a tie. Third case, 666 six, six and 661. Six, so, Alice wins. As for Alice, it will be 666. Six, six. While for Bob, it will be 661. Six, now, in this case, there are two solutions. One solution can be Simply you store the numbers in a vector and sort them out in descending order. So suppose I store 3 to 5 and then I sort them. It would become, the list would become 5, 3, 2 then I need to form a number from this and similarly for Bob it will be 611 instead of forming number you can also compare index by index and return the answer and another solution can be just take the sum of the numbers so you can take the sum of this number and this number uh, but this solution won't work always given an example we take 5 3 2 and here I take 5 9 2 So yes, this will also work. You may try it. And now we have mainly three solutions. One solution, two solutions are from list. We form list. Compare index by index. First solution. Second solution is we are combining it to form a number and then comparing. And third solution is taking the addition of the two numbers. So if the numbers become equal, give the output as tie. If the second array is greater, give Bob as output, otherwise Alice. So this is the solution to this problem. I hope you all understand it. Thanks for watching.